People, welcome to the brand new Ultra Hate video. He just unplugged the SSD for the episode. Anyway, anyway, carry on. Shop.gasworks.tv is the best way to support us. YouTube doesn't like to monetize us, we swear. We talk about things that, you know, they don't want us to talk about. Hello, Paul. Yeah, what's that, love? Gasworks sales, what's going on? You want a hat? No problem, man. Is that an order in a shop already? 100%. Hang up, we don't want them, they probably stink. Oh, hey, shop.gasworks.tv is the best way to support us. If we've ever made you laugh, ever made you smile, you know how sick this show is, you know how hard it was to get this on our own channel. But people, man, come on, the lights, they're expensive, you know. We literally got to keep them on. Where can they go, Jack? Gasworks.shop. All right, shop.gasworks, you bastard. Anyway, hey, Pope, um, I'm going to go next door. Um, I think King's there. Hi, man. Hey. You can't include that, man! <laughs> Welcome back to the greatest show on planet Earth, people. Round of applause for Gasworks. <laughs> Feels good to be back. Be it back does. in this room. Do you know what I'm saying? Even though we've been back, but still doing this. Do you know what I'm saying? Because that mm -hmm. felt like it was a one-off, and then now it's part of a routine. You know what I mean? Everything I need to get used to it, though. I've done a, a mistake today. You're not going to actually be able to see what I'm bringing up purely because it's the colour green. I brought again for the second time the Fourthy Fella jersey that is green to wear, and guess what? We can turn the green screen off for just a sec. Cool, and now put it back on. See, that's it. Well, back on the Philip Schofield thing, my man has come out and addressed it. Um, I don't know, I feel like that story is just gonna... Do you think anything's gonna happen? Nah, man, just... We all know, man, the investigations ain't gonna lead to shit. Oi, one minute, one Go minute. Go on. I wanna know... Yeah. Because the way this shit got brushed under the carpet, bro. Yeah. What happened to that Nicola Bully? Who's Nicola Bully? That woman that got went missing in the river and they never found her body. No, and then they found her body, but it'd been like two, three weeks. Big one. Nicola Bully, bro. The, wo the woman that went to drop her kids off to school, then went to walk her dog, and then she just disappeared. And then they found her body three weeks later on the marshland next to the, the river. Have After I never heard of this story, big man? Oh, you know, put your hand up if you know about Nicola Bully. One, two, three. So four. I'm the minority. Right, no, you don't know my about My brother. Usa, Levels Jewelry, he don't know, my brother. You don't know about Nicola Bully, bro? No, we didn't know. Bro, you live on the timeline, bro. This one, bro. Serious, look at her, man. Wait, that is a weird case, you know. I'm not one for conspiracy theories. I don't really care about, you know, uh, people that, you know, armchair uh, detectives. Yeah. But, bro, that was like top story for weeks, bro. So she was literally just walking her, her dogs. She's walking her dogs. Yeah. There was CCTV footage of her leaving the yard. Yeah. And then she went to some part of the park and there was one camera that used to look on that angle from a caravan park, but coincidentally it was turned off. Or As you working. do. Um, but yeah, they couldn't find her body. They had a rescue team, divers looking all over the, the river, the lake, wherever it's called. And then they found it like, found her body two, three weeks later. Um, no, was it two weeks? I don't know. Right. More than a week later. Um, on the marshland, you know, like the, the, the long straw grass. Yeah, 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 come on fam, we had little marshes. But in the, where they found her body was the bit that kind of is, runs parallel to the road, but it kind of touches. So what they're saying is someone overnight could have just thrown her body there. Because my man, the diver was like, bro, I've been searching this lake all day, every day for God knows how long, and I've not seen her body, I would never have missed that. And so now they just found it over there, it leads people yeah, to but, believe that it was placed there when they found that memo looking yeah, but, over there. But what makes it weird is her husband was doing mad interviews and he was just mad, like, suck. You know, like, did you ever see that guy in America who killed his two kids and his wife? No. And then he came home to them. Chris Bermot? No, Chris Watts. Chris Watt. It's always a Chris, you know, but yeah, carry on. Chris. That's why everybody hates them. Anyway, my man is a guy in America. There's been a mad Netflix documentary about it recently. Yeah. Um, but I've seen it on YouTube and he killed his own family and then he came home kind of acting as if they've been missing and he's trying to help the police, but these times he knows, you know, he was the one that done it. It's so crazy now. We just put every little conspiracy thing that happens in life and say, Netflix documentary soon. Like, I want to see the COVID one. I hope I've got a lead role in it. I want to see the COVID Why documentary. Why would you have a lead role in it? Why not? You could be the swab that goes up noses. <laughs> uh, Beyonce. Big man. Let me just stop everyone. Big man. Guys, gotcha. Beyonce has broke boundaries. She's overcome stereotypes. She's a fearless, brave, and courageous woman. She 
is the first woman to sell out mm -hmm. a football stadium. <laughs> Round of applause, everyone. Tottenham Hotspurs was packed out to see women. Well, a woman. A woman? She had dancers that were women. Mad, bro. Shout out her daughter. Came out, done her thing as well. Yeah, big up. Um, I feel like I don't know how you're getting away with this. I'm just saying, bro. When have we ever seen that much people go to a football stadium for a woman's performance? 100 metres at this point. Uh, yeah, so big up Beyonce. 100%. It's right. nice to see. Because, you know, I was watching the, the Women's World Cup. Um, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. Can you believe I was? Um, and, bro, like, they've just got bare crisis actors Would up you? on the stands. Like, they're not fans, bro. They're men are just... They're, they're men are crisis actors, bro. Women's football doesn't have... So, it was nice for a change. You know, to see, um, to see that. It was nice to see people walking out of the Tottenham Stadium happy. Yeah. Doesn't happen too often. <laughs> no <laughs> way. Come on, Arsenal! But Round of applause for Craig Mitchell Kick Game. Yeah, Kick Game doing its thing, fam. Let me tell you something. Kick Game is exactly what Complex UK should have been. Do you know what I'm uh... saying? Complex have got sneaker shopping. They could have done that in the UK. But no. JP wants to do articles all day. <laughs> no, I'm joking, I'm joking. All right, big up. Speak up, JP, man. Yeah, he wrote, he wrote, he wrote, he wrote, guy, yeah, man. No, he wrote about my articles. Well, big up him for real. Come on, man. But it's um, nice to see uh, Mitch's trajectory, man. I've obviously seen him for lie. time. He's Mitch, done his thing, man. He's doing well. He's, he's done his well. thing, my brother. Look at you being nice. What did you eat this morning? Oh, yeah. We won. We won. We won. What did you say about who? Mitch has done his thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're an Egypt, brother. Yeah, big up him. Um, I think he's doing a new makeup campaign with Garnier. And Louis, yeah, yeah, yeah. Free up them guys that done the Sky streaming thing. Who done the Sky streaming? What the football, bro. When? Oh, poet, fuck off. I'm I really haven't seen anything now, man. Bro. I've been watching Sky. How, how many years did them guys get for the Premier League? Oh my streaming? god, they got a right. long time, bro. Hey, let me run up. Hey, free them up, bro. But they were doing three o'clock games, they were doing everything. You just said Sky, you restricted it. They were giving everyone oh, access is it, is to it? everything. Right, yeah, cool. man. Listen. Shah, you doing your thing, fam. Now, I know we hear a lot of, you know, it's like a cliche thing to say, oh, mm. my man got more than a pedo, my man got more than a rapist, bro. How long did they get? What was it, like 30, 30 years between them, bro? And how but is it more know? because they made like, do you remember they make like three mil? It does, bro, but this is what I'm saying though. Why, right. like, cool, money is, you know, like, that's what I'm saying. Money is the root of all of these decisions that get made in, 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 in life. That's a good point, you know? Look at money, yeah, for real. Like, cool, money, but you can hit them where it hurts financially, bro. Why would you have to be locked up for that long? You're streaming football games, bro. Like, is that a serious crime? I got a serious question. When they come out, see that money that apparently they would have robbed or what have you, do they have to pay it back? Uh, no. Their sentence would be the... Well, I don't know what the... If it's part of... The, if, if they have to pay, but their sentence is part of... Um, their, their sentence is their punishment. So I doubt they'll serve 30 years or whatever it is between them um, and then come out and have to... Like, that's fucked. But it, that's what I'm saying. It should be... It's a civil case, bro. It's between the Premier League or FIFA or whoever it is and these guys. They can sue them. They can take them to court. They can do, you know, whatever. They should sue them financially, bro, to get locked up. Yeah, it's a bit of a mad thing still. It's mad. You can't be in, yeah, because you're going to be with some lifers. You're going to be with some people doing a long time. And yeah. just knowing that you just wanted to watch the cool Coventry City versus Blackburn just doesn't you know feel saying? right. Bro, Aston gonna... Villa. You can't get locked up for watching Aston Villa versus Fulham and just giving it to the man them. It's fucked, bro. That's a service. It's fucked. People, this is Gasworks. And today we've got a very special guest for you. Um, you know... I'd say we, yeah. but I think it's a decision that I've kind of made yeah. on this show that we don't have Americans, right? 100%, it's all down to you. Now, I woke up today and I made, you know, a call to have this Yankee on. But I don't know if it's the right call. Are we gonna regret having this fucking American kid on? Uh, have we checked if he's got... Nah, dead joke, dead joke. Dead joke. Whoa! I feel good. Na, 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 na. Some people have released good music. UK rap. She don't listen to UK drill, was it? Just hear my whole always rap. Uh uh, send a location. Uh 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 uh. What did you say? I've lost my trailer for. Slim's released. Slim. That's nice to see Slim. Back outside. Feels good to come home to double Lars and Richard Mills. I can relate, bro. I wish I could. Private school was tough. Come home to double Lars and Richard Mills. Believe me. Sorry? Yeah, man. Our hand's back, you know. Where's H? Where is H? Where's H? 
something tells me our hand's gonna say something inappropriate. That's better. Mm. Manchester. Come on. It's a good letter, man. RD, stay there for a bit. Um, anyway, yeah, back to today's special guest. We've not, never had an American on. They are banned from this show. But we've spoken to the uh, American embassy and we're going to make a slight... Uh... I get why Adi don't like you. Who? I get why Adi don't like you. I get it. Who? Why is my man chatting about uh, DiCaprio? <laughs> No, but where are these artists though, bro? Where are all of these rappers? Maybe just chilling out. Sometimes you have okay. to live, you know? Okay. Sometimes okay. live. Where, where's Gasworks been? This is why this show is mad, you know? Because we're trying to introduce a guest three times. 100% and he hasn't been able to come out. This guy is an internet... Uh, how would... Sensation. Wait, you know what? Let's, let's introduce him as if we are on... Uh, Good Morning. So this young black man has come through so many... Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Try that, Matthew. <laughs> yeah. Carry on. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, introducing internet megastar, superstar, uh, my favourite drug, Speed! <laughs> going on, my boy? How's it going? How's it going? How's Come it going? On. Hello, brother. How are you? Welcome Good. to Welcome to Guessworks. Hello, brother. How are you? Yep. What, what show are you on right now? Guessworks. All right. Have um, you ever watched Guessworks? Do you know what this is? Yeah. You know, y'all talk about how um, you guys talk about how um, how you know how. <laughs> Speed. There's a question we like to ask every special guest, and that question is: Are you a bowcat? A boker? A bowcat. Bowcat. Mm. Bowcat. T. Bo-cat. What is that like, uh, like, like English? That's English. That is English. Or is it a yardy term? Uh, probably a yardy term. It's become part of our language now. No, like American. Like, what does that mean, American? I heard that it means, what is it? Munch. Munch. Oh, am I a munch? Oh, am I a munch? Mm. Am I a munch? Oh, God. <sighs> what? Man, I'm just like, I don't know. It depends, you know? It depends. Wait, I was just like, let me get to the bottom of this. I'm like trying to get, just wait, just give me about 10 seconds. I'm just I'm almost there. Why did he want to get to the bottom? Show you two in the front. Just wait, I promise you I'm about to. Okay. Here we go, here it comes, here, here it comes the answer. Here it comes the answer. If he lets one rip, he's a G. I feel like he is. <laughs> no, I knew it. I just knew it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, bro, yes, I'm a bouquet, yes, bro, uh, yes. Wait, you know what, no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not. You're not. I never did it, so I never won't. <laughs> so what was that first answer about? Huh? What was that first answer about? First answer? No, I'm, I'm just thinking of like, just like a, a nice looking booty. That's all I'm thinking about. Let's see, my boy. Ooh. Ooh, is that a Man United? Ooh. Man like speed. Man like speed. I don't know, what does that mean? <laughs> Mmm, okay, okay. I see where he's coming from now. It's art, this is right here is art. This is, this is right here just complete art. You see, you're feeling that one? Yeah, I'm feeling it. Off-white joint, yeah? You know, it's just art, you know, like just calm art. You feel what I'm saying? It's just, when you look at it, you like, that's art. This is an art, artistic type of, you know, thing. Yup, and the pants, yup. Calm art, I like this, bro. Nah, this is fire, bro. I don't know what this is though. This is fine. Like glasses as well. Casablanca. Oh, feels right. Come on, fam. Casablanca Paris. Have a look at open. I got a feeling this is like expensive, bro. Come on, G. <laughs> I just don't know what it is though, bro. <laughs> like all these boxes and shit. Like holy Bruh, shit. Oh my brother, you are ready for the summer. When I met you in the summer, I don't know the rest of the words. What song is that? Um, Calvin Harris. All right, Speed, welcome to the UK for like, what, the 20th time? Third. You like, you like it? You're feeling it here? Yeah, yeah, I like here, I like here, I like here. What's going on? Why do you keep coming back? Why do I keep coming back? Because, bro, it's like, it's, it's like a second home here, you know? Like I said, me growing up in the slums of Manchester, 
every day, bro. Like this shit, bro. This shit was hard, bro. Y'all saying you're laughing? This shit ain't funny, bro. <laughs> Where about in Manchester, G? Huh? Have you seen over there? What's yeah. Tunde saying actually? You saw what? Tunde. But you grew up in Manchester, but you should know. What's, what's Tunde saying? How about Meeks? Bro, it's like, yeah. Just man, just man call. My brother Kane. Bro, I speak English, bro. This doesn't feel this right. <laughs> Give me oh, yeah. your best Manchester accent, seeing as you grew up there. Um, you know, it's sunny in it, you know. <laughs> Stop laughing, bro. Like, I'm being serious. Bro, this is my, like, I'm from Manchester, bro. Come on, my brother. I don't talk about your accent, so, I, so you don't talk about my uh, accent, all right? No problem, my brother. I do apologize. Back to the Manchester living. Yeah, it's sunny in it. Uh, yeah, did you see Harry Maguire? He didn't, he didn't score the ball, did he? He didn't Rashford. He missed the goal wide open. And, I don't you became Jamaican all of a sudden. I've been there, cuz. Bro, this is my accent, bro. Like, that's just where I'm from. I'm from Manchester. You from what? Brixton or something. <laughs> <laughs> right, bro, two different things. So, what was it like growing up in Manchester as a kid compared to now? You know, See, as a kid, you know, uh, like I said, you know, you got people outside every day playing football. You know what I'm saying? Then you go to Tommy House, you know, Tommy, you know. Which Tommy? Tommy in it. You call him Tommy in it. Yeah, like, yeah, like Tommy in it. Like, that's what we do, like, in Manchester. Like, Water in it, you feel what I'm saying? Like we just put the in it at the end. You know, feel me? it's just more of an accent thing. You know what I'm saying? It's more of an accent. But yeah, so yeah, so Manchester it was nice going outside every day. You know what I'm saying? Watching the Man United games, being a Man United fan. You got the Man City. You know, you know, we used to have like fist fights and shit. You know what I'm saying? Because we didn't, you know, because I was on a Man United game, so you know, I was like, you know, ten fist years, fights, yeah, yeah, you know, ten not, years old, just not, fighting and stuff. I'm a Man United ups. fan, you know. I like Nani Rio Fernandez. Cause look, back in my day, Nani Rio Fernandez. You know, Ronaldo, he was playing on there. Fernand who? Rio Fernandez. Oh, the, uh, Ferdinand. Yo, this guy, was, okay, bro. You know, the CB, who else are they? Oh, yeah, and Rooney. So, like, yeah, so that, so that was back in my area. So, back in my area, like I said, it was like a good United area when we went to UCL back in 2008. So, uh, if you grew up in Manchester, where did you get the American accent from? See, the thing about that, people tell me that about all the time, you know. See, that's a. That's have, you, have you ever realized that you've got an American accent? To be honest, I don't know what kind of accent do I have. I don't know. Mm, like, do I, I mean, pe people say like I sound like Southern to an yeah, extent. Yeah, maybe. People say I sound like like American. I don't know what the hell do I sound. I think sound it's like. a half Scouse. Scouse, yeah. it's interracial. And um, what part of like South? When you say Southern, where in South? Like like England South? Oh. Or like American South? No, see the thing. See, I've been telling my story. Like I said, bro. When when, when I was twelve years old, I got brought back to um, America for some reasons. I don't want to talk about it. Cause okay, no problem. No, yeah. I think we should dive into it. Yeah, like my Wind grandma. Windrush was a real thing. Yeah, my grandma passed away, some shit, everything happened. And that's where I just came disconnected, you know, and, I, and it left a lot of trauma. So I, I kind of forget about my life back in Manchester. So it leaves a lot of trauma. <laughs> You're laughing, bro? I just talked about my grandma di dying. Did she die in Manchester or in America? Huh? Did she die in Manchester or America? <sighs> she died in Wales, Wait, but bro. This might be the story of 21 Savage. Really? So yeah, your, your grandma passed away in Manchester. Mm, sad. And then you went to America. Yeah, and I went to America at an early age. I went to this place called Ohio, you know. When I went, and when I entered Ohio, bro, it was different, bro. I'm talking about, you see stuff different. Everything, people's different. You got people barking. You got people bouncing around. You got, it's so much shit different. And I've like, and all that. When you say bouncing and barking, what, what do you mean? Like, you know, <laughs> and you know, and like bouncing their asses and shit. Wait, what? People that, are just walking around do think, barking? Do you think that may have been part of the trauma of your grandma dying, maybe? She, my grandma, death was very, like, un, un, like, like un, undiagnosed. I didn't tell you, but my, but my grandma lived in Wales, but, and my mom, you know, lived. <laughs> Why are you laughing, bro? My bad, I shouldn't laugh at these My things. grandma, like, lived in Wales, but my mom, like, when she had me, and, like, and when, when me and my dad had each other, she moved to Manchester. You and your dad, you and your dad had each other? Yeah. Yeah, that's, hey, big up speed that as well though. Yeah, so then I went to Manchester, then since then America, then boom, you know, it just a lot of shit, bro. Like a lot of stuff has happened. It's my life. Like my grandma death was very post post metratic. Um so there was barking. Yeah, barking, bouncing asses, bro. Like it's just you see different animals. Okay, what just, animals did you see? Huh? What animals? Bro, just like bro, like weird animals. Like I'm talking about you see a dog that has three legs, right? But they run as fast as a dog with four legs. Perseverance. You get what I'm saying? Mm. You see, like, it's just different, bro. Everything you see is different. People talk different. People act different. So I kind of got my stuff based off on that. You feel what I'm saying? Did they sound like you when you arrived? 
I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah. It's crazy. So, I guess, yeah, bro. Must feel at like home. Yeah, bro. So no, 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 no. They sounded different. That's why I had this accent now. They sounded oh, different. Oh, they changed your accent. Yeah, bro. So yeah, they changed my accent. So that's why I talk like this. So now that you're back in London, uh, who's kind of shown you around the city? Me. Oh. I think you spent some time with Chunks, right? Yeah, Chunks. Yeah, Chunks. Good guy. Yeah. Yeah. Chunks, Chunks is a he's a great singer. Yeah, he is. Yeah, I wish like I love how to like when he sing like I just like damn I get. Like, damn, he kind of sexy, like, but mm. if he uses that to, like, get some, like, he can pull some nice girls with that. What's that voice he is, bro? That shit, it's, it's lovely. Whatever. Who, who, who else been looking after you while you been here, man? Chunks, yeah, Chunks been, um, looking after, looking after out me, um, who else? Shit. You know, just me, you know, me? Yeah, just me, and, yeah, Chunks. Just Chunks, that's it. What? That's it. Ain't no one else trying to hold you down. Just Chunks is the only person. I mean, yeah, like, yeah, like, I got my crew with me. I see your crew crazy. You know, I'm a man, you know, I got to take care of my own self. You feel what I'm saying? No, but it's nice if you come and you touch down, someone can just show you around and not just the, the nice stuff. Bro, you stuff. keep forgetting I'm from here, bro. Oh, that's right. So you're not, you're not, that's you're not from why. Here. You're from Manchester, it's different. It's not culturally different. It's, 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 it's the same thing. I think our culture's. Really and, you know, as a kid, I used to take the train to London sometimes. <laughs> like, damn, like, For real? I remember being like fucking eight years old. Going to the train station? Can I go to which, uh, which train station was it, bro? It was a train of John. The, the oh, King. I know that one. Yeah. You get it from I think it's Manchester Piccadilly. No, train station fifty one. It's so called fifty one. Yeah, train station oh, okay. fifty one of John. So, it was the king who died from like man man. Yeah, that. tell you my man. You know he took me to Nando's for the first time. And See. That, and as a black man coming to Nando's, how does that feel? It's crazy. You know That's back. Right. They didn't have Nando's when I was living in Manchester. Why not? I don't, bro. Probably because my grandma died, bro. But. Oh, so she couldn't take you? Yeah, bro, so. But she bust you with alcohol. What are you talking about? Yeah, UK slang is crazy. Yeah, like this guy's like, I don't know what he's waffling about. He's just, like, you're saying words, but I don't comprehend what you're saying. Can't piece them together to make a sentence. Yeah. But you understood that. If you've grown up in Manchester. And I thought you would London, understand, yeah. yeah. You we have different it. accents. Manchester London has different accents. You yeah, know that's what I mean? true. This, yeah. yeah. We talk more delightful. Y'all talk more. Ohio's got a disgusting accent, but Ooh. I'll be real. No, we don't. We. I think, I think so, you know. I haven't. I literally have an Ohio accent. You're quite cute, you know. Stop. Look at him blushing. I'm not blushing, bro. And what, what about that earring? Was oh. you the earring? What? Face that way. Hey, don't play with him, you know. What do you mean, bro? Speed the game. How old are you now? Like, huh? We're like four. I'm 19. I'm 19. I turn My 20. My guy, you know. Yeah, I turn 20 next week. Ross. Huh? Leaving the team. What? Leaving the teens. Yeah. Big man now. Right, yeah. So I turn 20 next week, you know? Life been crazy, you know? Obviously, Speed, chatting about some of these uh, UK dons, you know. The UK dance? Dons, dons. Dance? Dons. Dance? Dons. People. Oh, people. Like, you know when your grandma died? Dons. Yeah. Yeah, makes sense, man. Trust me, if he ever gets confused, just make it about his grandma. Nah, you can't do that, man. You don't, you understand? Just say it's the just American one. Just talk American, bro. bro. Okay, dance. We don't say that. So what do you lot say? Dance. People? Yeah, Yeah, right. just say people. Cool. Yeah. Who else is ranking uh, quite high on your list in terms of uh, UK people that you like? Oh, the people... Uh, YouTubers. I see, I see, uh, I see KSI running some... Yeah, uh, KSI's fucking last, bro. Fuck KSI, I hear you. So he's saying that he doesn't want you on this year's uh, Sadman charity, so... Yeah, bro, so I'm it's... saying we, we infiltrate. Why? Wait, why? You was the highlight. Me, personally, I think my man might be a bit, um... What's the word? Feel away about speed. No, yeah. I just think... I don't, bro, so nah, to be I honest... Like I don't know if it's... I don't know, but like, with KSI, I don't know if it's... Is this, if, it's not serious, is it? I don't know. Nah, man. I'm taking it as, like, I don't know. Because, like, like I said, I, I don't talk to the guy. Mm. Every time when I talk to him, I gotta, like, read a clip. You know what I'm saying? It's like... It's like we're talking through a clip. I watch a clip of what he says, he watch a clip of what I says. You know what I'm saying? It comes with that. But if he doesn't like me, he doesn't like me. I mean, I don't know why. Oh, you hit him up? Huh? You hit him up? I do. What did he say? Well, I think I... Yeah. I, I, yeah. Yeah. Could be something to do with the Huh? Could be something to do with the Rumble. KSI, I don't know. I don't know what is between me and him, bro. Like I said, I don't know if he's serious or like... See what KSI... But in America, like how I, like how I see is like he's serious. I don't know like about the UK humor or whatever, but but, I, but I'm taking it serious, bro. I'm taking it really serious. So the equivalent in America, serious things. Over here, you're not too sure. Bro, what I'm saying is that in America, we taking it serious and like like in the UK, bro, like I don't know how y'all humor works, bro, but like oh. we don't play that in Ohio, bro. That's you know what I'm saying? So if you're talking smack, bro, okay. you're talking shit. But who have you had to stick it on in Ohio then? What problems have you had in Ohio and you activated? 
Bro, this one time, bro, two <sighs> to them. This bro, see, look, this one time, right? I'm chilling, right? It's me and my uncle, right? Why are you laughing, bro? Say, go ahead, say, I just, I just laugh when I'm telling the stories. Well, look, I'm chilling, like, it's with uh, me and my uncle, and we're at this uh, amusement park. Y'all know what an amusement park is? Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. Amusement park, roller coaster. Theme, huh? theme, theme park. Theme park. Yeah. Uh, theme park, right? So at the theme park, it's like animals and shit. It's animals. Like, you can ride donkeys, you can ride cows, you can ride. Wait, we call that a zoo. I don't, I don't care what y'all call it, bro. But an amusement park has roller coasters and shit. Yeah. Sorry, Speed, carry on. So in the theme park, there are farm zoos, whatever. In UK, they're zoos, right? So look, it was this donkey, right? It was this donkey, the, the it was this it was this guy who ran the donkey little things. And I wasn't, they were saying like like I wasn't too tall to ride the donkey. So so like me and my uncle was like, hold on. Then he made a comment like, <laughs> look at this little kid. How old are you, kid? You're not the uh, donkey? And I looked at him. And I looked at my uncle. And my uncle looked at me, but he gave me the nod, like, you do it. And I came up to him, I was like, yo, bro, what did you say to me, bro? What did he say about my donkey? So, uh, so then I made a joke. I was like, because y'all know donkey means ass. Like, in America, it means like ass. Like, donkey ass, something like that. So I made a joke. So then I, like, I, like, licked the donkey tail and smacked him with the, the yo. <laughs> What just happened? But how, do you, like, obviously looking down on her grandson, how do you think she would have felt? Oh no, not my grandson, my aunt. My aunt passed away. Oh, so your grandma's grandma still here? Oh, so your grandma's still here? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, my aunt. Yeah, bro, my, yeah, my, me and my aunt passed away. How was she? Huh? What do you, bro, she's, she's. Oh yeah, not so good. Do you miss her? Yeah, I miss her, man. Fondest memories? Yeah, I miss my aunt. I what was the best aunt. memories? Uh, it was this thing she used to do, and like, um, I remember this one time she spent the night over my grandma's house, and, mm. and I was over my grandma's house, and my aunt, uh, she used to do this thing when she was asleep, she used to like rub her feet, like, against the carpet, like, just out of nowhere in the middle of the night, and I thought that was funny, because I was just weird. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, yeah. Speed, listen, obviously, your goat. It's uh, Ronaldo. What's his name? Yeah, Ronaldo. What do you mean, what's his name? You know Christian Ronaldo. I'll find that guy, man. Messi. Okay. So you look like a Messi fan, bro. Like, How does probably look like a Messi fan, bro? You're like Brandon Ingram. You're like some NBA small forward. Oh. He's not small. There's nothing small about Poet. Huh? What? There's nothing small about Poet. No, it's the, no, the position is small forward. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's how that sport sounds interesting. Is that, is that where uh, Ben Simmons used to play? So, why does Poe look like a Messi fan? Huh? Why does Poe look like a Let's Messi Let's just get back fan? to Ronaldo. Bro. Sorry, sorry, Ronaldo. He's looking you up and down. Like, look, oh, bro. Like, why for that? Why for the eyesight? Lift he, up. He smells like a, a Italian incense. Then when he smells, he does that. <laughs> you know, and he... Yeah, and he just... Yeah, bro. And he just... Yeah, bro. Yeah. He just... Yeah, man. Just him, man. You feel me, man? So anyway, back to Ronaldo. Mm -hmm. uh, has he sunk in your eyes as a hero since his? Uh, yeah, bro. Time? I generally look up to Ronaldo. I generally yes. I, I I love that guy to the fullest. I mean, I yes, bro. And I really generally like that guy. And I love him a lot, bro. And I fell in love with him, bro. How do you feel about his uh, transfer to Saudi, Saudi? Arabia? <laughs> Does it make him not look as starish to you anymore? No, actually, I was. I was talking to my guy, Ben Thomas. I think he went. Uh, Conte, mm -hmm. Black, Black Conte. Mm -hmm. so, I and mean, I think, um, yeah, yeah, like, like, like people was following him. You know what I'm saying? People was following. Him. Messi Mostly starting a new trend. Are they saying, are they saying Messi's going to Saudi? Nah, Messi retired. He's going to Inter Miami. He left PSG. What's that? Inter Miami is a team in Miami. Go on, what? Why don't you like America? Not this like is a good America. question. He doesn't. He hates him. You're the first guest. He's never wanted. Yeah, we, we've never guest. had a Yankee. Why don't you like America? Here we go. I don't know, man. It's a bit. Uh, it's give nice. us three things. Three things you don't like about America. Speed. Okay. Speed's on. Oh, it's... And one genuine thing that maybe Speed can help us with. Chunks. One bro. Sorry, bro. It's just you know. It's just taken up. <laughs> yeah, it's just, you know, I'm tired of hearing about it, man. Would you like to try a beverage from the UK? We can go to another, though. Supermom? 
Super malt. Have you ever had sweet malt before? Not alcoholic. Yep, I'll try it. Most of my friends used to drink this drink quite a bit when we were younger. What do you reckon? He likes it. He doesn't like it. What is this? I say everyone in NG used to drink it's it. It's like Coke and medicine at the same time. Not a fan? Not a fan of Supermalt. You know, I've always thought Supermalt was like a... Go on. Imagine all brand. All brand. Don't care, bro. Don't care, bro. I'm not going to lie. Don't care, bro. Hey, come and just punch this. You just get a million views live. Crazy. You should punch him up live. Best footballer you met, though. Best football player I met? Yeah, let's just stick to football. Out of all the footballers you met, which is quite a few, which one's the most comfortable, most calm that you still kind of talk to today? I real or like... Digital. Real. Um, I would either either go Raphael mm. or Felix. Young Felix. But I spent more time with Felix, so I might have to go with Felix. Mm, but not Raphael. Raphael's my boy, but I only spent, he had to do some things after while I was in Portugal. Oh, serious? Yeah, but I, but like, I actually spent time with Felix and shit. You can spend time with Felix. I say, I say, I say, I say Raphael and Felix. Who's the footballer that reached out to you and you were like, I cannot believe this person has reached out to me? Like when Messi, you found out Messi bought oh, you. Oh, yeah, amazing. bro. Reached out to me, reached out to me. I have to say, probably Richardson? I, yeah, I probably have to go with Richardson. Richardson? Yeah. Which one? The Charleston hit you up? Yeah. Serious? Mm -hmm. He is miserable. What do you mean? He's a, basically, he scored four goals this season. Only one actually counted, and for all four of them, he took his top off. So for three times, it was a waste of time, VAR. So everyone kind of kind of clowns him. One goal this season. I only have one goal this season? Stinks. No way. Absolutely. Actually? Stink. One goal, bro. I hear what I'm screaming, though. I, I'm, I'm hearing you're going to Istanbul to watch uh, the fans. Yes, sir. Who yep. would you rather win, Man City or... Uh, Inter, Inter Milan. Inter why? What do you mean, why? I just told you I was in the Man United game when I was... Younger, so obviously I'm gonna go with Inter Milan. Do you know any Turkish? Yeah. What do you know? Uh. When you get to Istanbul, you gonna say I'm gonna go to Manchojo. It's not. It's not Turkish. No. I'm gonna go to Manchojo. Seni bu barmalaklarını sikiyim. Listen to what I'm saying to you. I'm gonna. Bro, you're not from Turkey. Are you from Turkey? Legit. Yeah. Wait. What are you? He's Turkish. You're Turkish. Actually, I'm Turkish. So like, so like kind of Turkish. The other half is Jamaican. Jamaican. You wouldn't know that. That's a weird mix. Jamaican and Turkey. What, Manchester, Ohio, and your aunt dying on a donkey, he's not. Senin saçını sikiyim. What? Senin saçını sikiyim. Senin saçını sikiyim. That means, what I'm saying to speed there is, good luck at the football. What do you want Senin Milan to win? Even though Ronaldo almost signed for a season. So. Any last words while you're here in London? Um. Hey, big up, by the way, man. I know this is your first ever interview. You get me, so. Yeah. Thanks for coming. Yeah, my first time something like this, yeah. I agree. You you different feeling? It? Huh? Different feeling? Yeah. Yeah. Kind of like, yeah. Good or bad? I don't know. I ain't gonna love myself. You're doing too much perfect for me. I ain't gonna love <laughs> What do you say? God knows. He don't even Yeah, know. see, exactly. See, look. When I do a higher one, you, it's different now. No, 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 no. What the hell was that? I should have started using my sling the whole time, but. Come on. You, ain't got, you men ain't got slang. Yes, yes, we do have slang. Oh, well, slang do you have in Ohio? Slang. Like I said, bro, stop. Later. Say it again, say it again. Do you mean that's the, that's all it is? Ain't gonna lie, bro. Ain't gonna lie. Bro, stop perping, ain't gonna lie. If you keep perping, I have to kill you, bro. Ain't stop perping, bro. What's perping? What? Not perping, man. No, 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 don't explain it to these British people. They don't know. I thought you was British, weren't you? What? I thought, yeah, I thought you were from Manchester. Yeah, I'm from Man yeah, British is not Manchester. British is UK. Don't even come up. What? I said, what's perping, Ohio? Perping is a word, bro. Not perping, bro. P -E -R -P -I -N -G. Yeah. Okay. He perfect. He know what it means. Illegal use or possession of drug. No. No, no that's not it. It's like capping. Ah. Uh. Oh. Perfect. Okay. Give us some more. First ever interview. You get me. London's very own. No, no, Manchester's very own. You get me. Man like speed. Portugal. Portugal's very own. Portugal. Yeah? Portugal. Portugal. Yeah, mm -hmm. Portugal's very own. Any last words before you. Uh, any last words, good brother? Uh, ciao, ciao, uh, boa noite, uh, gente, uh, uh, caralho, uh, meu fola, meu família, uh, ciao, ciao, uh, de forma moista. 
Kaslan. Now you go start your boss na ke uh Elis Sam Elis Elis Sam foi muito caralho. Oi 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 oi. Oh, my God.